Hi, today we are going to discuss about single needle click clack method in 4008s machine. Why I am creating this video is for educating all our dialysis staffs about single needle click clack method. Always remember single needle click clack hemodialysis can only be used if the functioning needle is not placed retrograde. That means returning into the anastomosis. Single needle hemodialysis does remove fluid effectively but provide minimal diffusion is because of recirculation value is very high is around 80 percentage. A central venous catheter with one functioning lumen could also can use this method. Heparin free hemodialysis is not recommended for single needle hemodialysis due to frequent starting and stopping of the blood pump and thus increased likelihood of the blood line and dialyzer clotting. Single needle hemodialysis can be initiated at start of treatment or after double needle hemodialysis has been started. It is also possible to return to or start double needle hemodialysis at any time. That is, if the second needle has been established. We need three-way connector as extra equipment for single needle hemodialysis. Let's talk about procedure. First go to treatment mode and select this upper limit and lower limit. Upper limit is around 350 to 400 and lower limit is 50 to 100 and select a anti-grade needle that means away from the anastomosis and after that connect a three-way connector and connect artery and venous line into the three-way connector and after that you can switch on all the clamps the needle clamps and arterial clamps and venous clamp and go to SN menu and switch on the treatment mode then the cyclic alarm will come and followed by single needle click clack menu will appear so that means it started and observe the venous pressure is going up why because the clamp is closed now and this is released then venous pressure will come down see so observe the clamp now now it's closed is open and pump is off so blood is returning to it and pump is on clamp is off venous pressure is going high and reach 400 once it's reached 400, pump will stop, clamp will release and blood will go into patient. And again, clamp off, blood on. And then this time, blood will won't go into a patient body. This is going to dialyzer. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned. More points we'll discuss on next episode.